Right. Liliana! The stars are out. Hmm. Uh, great. So, go help Alice to make up for once a clear night. Even in this dark times. Like, the like, wind's right. Even in this dark, chaotic time, there is still beauty to be found in this world. It comforts me to know that the stars will remain untouched by the blight. That whatever happens down here, they will shine eternally. Their light undimmed. There is a story about that cluster of stars over there. Do you know it? Elindra and her soldier? I... Um, no, tell me the story. A long time ago, there lived a fair maiden called Elindra. She had many suitors, but spurned them all for she did not love them. One day, Elindra was sitting by her window in her father's castle, singing and dreaming, when her lovely voice caught the attention of a young soldier. Entranced by her song, the soldier drew near to Elindra's window. As their eyes met, he fell in love with her, and she with him. When Elindra told her father about the man she had chosen, he was furious, for Elindra was high-born, but her love nothing more than a common soldier. To keep them apart, he had Elindra imprisoned in the highest tower of his castle, and sent her soldier to the walls. Alas, not a month had passed before news of the soldier's death reached Elindra. Alone in her tower, Elindra wept for her love, and beseeched the guards to deliver her from this cruel world. So earnest was her plea, that the gods themselves were moved. They gathered Elindra into their arms and lifted her high into the heavens, where she became a star. The gods also raised up the soul of Elindra's soldier love, and there he dwells, across the horizon from her. The band of stars between them is a river of Elindra's tears, cried for her lost love. They say that when Elindra has cried enough, she will be able to cross the river, to be reunited with her soldier. The, st the stars are not made of tears. I think, from what from what Kahiris understands, I think it's Liliana's just just a bard, just a bard. Um, I think because I think she was the servant to an Elysian lady, and so he kind of sees a kind of parallel to to their relationship because he's obviously the last Kusland were continually told um, and he he's he's the heir to the turn of high ever he's highborn he's the well currently the second most powerful man arguably um, in Ferelden rightfully you know you got you got um, Loghain Mactir uh, turn of is it turn of Gwerin or no turn of Gwared I think is it something begins with a G I'm sure and then you've got of course himself um, and Assumably, Alice is, the, Alice is the king, so I don't know. I don't know. But but yeah, in that case, he's the third most powerful man, rightfully. So, that is a beautiful story. This story is one of my favourites. A tale of a love so great and so enduring that it defies death and moves the gods to action. Sometimes I ask myself, does such a love exist? Can it exist? Hmm. Real love is a mix of lust and attachment, nothing more. Nope. Few loves are so powerful, it may exist, but it never lasts. If we lose hope in love, then we are truly lost. Um. Hmm. Um. I think he'd say that in the maybe i don't know maybe hmm. i think out of the four this is what he'd say if we lose hope in love then we're truly lost because there is value to love and i think that's saying oh well some love's just nah, nah, nah. but no if we lose hope in love then we are truly lost i never expected you to say that it is a pleasant surprise i'm secretly a terrible romantic well uh, that's true uh, why is it a surprise there is a certain severity to you. Finding a person behind that all is nice. Maybe you should let your softer side show more often. Sometimes, following your heart, not your head, leads you to remarkable places. Like you. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Um, right. So what are we doing now? Right, right. Um. Hmm. Hmm. I think we might take Sten to Orzuma. Not now, not now. We'll do that. Or should we take Shale to Ozumar? 
No, I, I haven't used Shale in ages, and I haven't used Sten in ages, and 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 I, I'm kind of feeling bad. No, okay, I think it's more a case of logically, it just doesn't make sense to some extent to have uh, like some of the times, like especially in Denim, it's been like we want to be somewhere secretive, like so a big iron golem who's lit up like a Christmas tree. I mean, with those colours, that's a fairly accurate description. Probably not useful. And obviously Sten, although, you know, you could argue Canary Mercenary, not exactly a big thing. Hmm. Part of me is tempted with it. I will buy a gift, well, I'll buy the gift I think is for Sten and talk to him. anything I can do for you, please, please tell me. Let me see your words. I'm sure you'll be pleased with the goods my boy and I have collected, and with your discount. Now, let me see if I can work this out. It's kind of a, it's, it's a thing of deduction, really, isn't it? So that's Alistair. That's uh, that's for the dog. That's for the secret companion. That's for Morrigan, Ogren. Amulet of Memories. Um, oh, Rare and Even Brandy. I'm guessing that's for Zevran. Amulet of Memories. Hmm. Okay, I'm guessing that's... Uh, and each one of these is a negative thing. I think, do they do they link like to like? It's the complete genealogy. I think so. I think that would be Alistair's, obviously, you know, a reminder of who he is. That's for Dog, obviously. No, no, they don't match up. They don't match up. Alas, that's not useful. Um... It's not going to be the Amulet of Memories, I don't think. The Cunari Prayers for the Dead. That would make sense, but it's a book. So I think that's wins, because I don't think she'd want a pet rock. So we'll grab the pet rock. In the vain hope that that is Sten's. Is that yours? Unwise. Oh, no. What? Oh, did I give him a bad thing? What happened then? Whose is it then? I, I must have... Pet Rock. It could well then be Shales. Oh, it is. Oops. Ooh, shiny. Please enter a name for Shales Pet Rock. Um... You know, names are important. We shouldn't take them for granted. Uh, we should try and think of a, a nice name so that it isn't Shale. Sorry. Sorry. Ah, uh, geology puns. They rock. Please don't unsubscribe. Um. Oh, come on. No, we've got to go with it. Nice. Nice. Yeah, let's talk to Shale then. So, did I then upset Z um, Sten by trying to give him the wrong gift? I can look at this and pretend I, I've see I can see how it changes, but I mean, I'll talk to him because he's now warm. So maybe we can get something else out of him. Yes. Yes. I want to discuss something you mentioned. Speak then. Uh, no, I didn't. Then I suggest we move on. Uh, I have a question. I am hardly surprised. Uh, I don't think so. No, I didn't. Very well. Sorry. As you wish. Sorry, the game tricked me. Right. Shale, can I ask you a new question? I've watched a lot of humans in my time. It should be aware that I have decided that it is not much like any of them. Um, but uh, that could be good or bad. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. That that, that could be good or bad. Good, of course. It doesn't want to have anything in common with all those other filthy substandard human types, does it? Surely it must come from some superior lineage, yes? Some breed of flesh creature that has decided to elevate its genetic stock above its natural shortcomings? I am a protagonist. Maybe that's it. Yeah, there's a backhanded compliment in there somewhere. I don't like where you're going with this. No, but... Well, you know, okay, okay, my father was the turn of high ever, if that's important. Oh, then that must be it. I knew there had to be some reason. 
it being a human <laughs> and all. Human. I would appreciate if it didn't spread around that I said anything. Humans might start to get the wrong idea. They might start thinking their race is not completely hopeless. Okay. Thanks for the vote of confidence. I'm guessing that's sarcastic. And we wouldn't want that. Oh, yes, I'll keep that to myself then. Now, let us crush something into a fine paste before it starts to think I've gone all soft. Perish the thought. Indeed. You're crazy. You're absolutely mental. I did say I would do one after every... Oh, I did say that, didn't I? I said I would do one after getting um, our allies. So... What's Sten's gift then? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, Cause I think I think we'd probably do Sten's, Evren. Maybe win. Well no 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 no. How many more have we got to do? We've got Oh we've only got two more to go, haven't we? We've got uh, once we get the urn and then when we get um when we deal with Orzuma. So there's only two more gifts left that I can do this that I'm allowing myself to do with. So I think Sten will definitely be one of them if I get it right. Are you sure I can't interest you in this hat? A pair of earrings. Yes, yeah, just show me your wares, sure Badan. Good... Let's see if I can. Okay, so so that obviously we were incorrect there. Um, who would it be then? Maybe it is the Kunari Press of the Dead, or it might be the Amulet of Memories. Because I thought that, that was Shales. Just I don't know. Maybe representing the memories of. Um, but I mean, he likes. Um, he likes, um, apparently, he likes, um, yeah, we can get thoughtful gifts, which I think are just random bonuses, aren't they? Sugar cake and guessing is a gift in and of itself, isn't it? So he likes paintings. I think we'll head to Redcliffe, actually, see if we can get, like, some more healing, because we're really lacking it, it feels like. So we're going to head to Redcliffe, so... Yes. Um, Indeed. Should we take the old crew? Indeed. Yeah. We'll head to Redcliffe. We haven't, we haven't, we haven't travelled with Morrigan in a while. Which is... Just... No, we went to Morrigan first when we went to the Brazilian, then we grabbed Wynn afterwards. Morrigan, Morrigan has levelled. Well, everyone's levelled. It's just... Um, right, so we'll boost your willpower and we'll put some into constitution just to keep you alive, I think. Expert herbalism. Uh, yeah. We won't use it, but there is an option. Shock. Why can't we go? Oh, you just need a little more magic to get these. Lost field. Curse of mortality. Sleep. All hostile targets in the area fall asleep unless they pass a metal resistance check. Oh, we'll go with sleep. Oh, we get another one. Hmm. Maybe... Shock. Yeah. Hmm. So I think we'll grab some more... Uh, grab some healing if we can. We might have another go with Flemeth then. We get, if we can get some healing here. Or we could just go somewhere else and try and level. Yeah, going somewhere else and leveling makes a bit more sense, I think. Right. Um, where's the shop? I think it's... Yeah, I think there is a general shop, isn't there? General store. Yes. I believe so. Around this way, I think. Through here. Ooh. Caitlin's home. Ah, that's where we got the green blade sword thing. Caitlin's home. General's. General store. Try and grab some healing if we can. Hmm. I feel uncom uncomfortable kind of just looting the place. But it might be worth just. Obviously, it's been raided. I shall do it. It's not even that good. Okay, we're deciding not to loot the place. That might have something to do with the fact that the, the loot is rubbish. Oh. That was worrying. 
Um, maybe, 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 maybe we should head to uh, Owens. Maybe he's he's a blacksmith. Blacksmith, though. Why would he have anything resembling healing? You'd assume he wouldn't. Assumably. You're welcome here, friend. What can I do for you? Uh, business. You're welcome to whatever I have, obviously. I'm at your service. Right. Um, no, I want healing. Healing, healing, healing. Oh, these are just random things I've sold you, aren't they? Yes, I think they are. I feel that they are. Hmm. hmm you don't have what I want. Right. Hmm. Is there some map telling me where things are? That's world map. World map. The tavern, maybe. Chantry. We'll have a look in the chantry and then have a look in tavern, see if that's where we can get healing. Go for handing in quests. Jetta! Oh, yes, I remember you. You had the um, side quest for... Uh, no, not Sir. We're going to say Sir Rodri. It wasn't, but I think the name was Rodri. He was the missionary. Oh, way back when. Make her bless you, child. Without your help, we surely would have lost. Mm. Murdoch. Good to see you again. Hi, Zaid. Uh, is everything all right? So far. I'll be fighting Darkspawn soon enough. I don't look forward to it. With the Maker's luck, I'll live through it all to tell my grandchildren a tale or two. Is to hoping you can do the same. I'm highly entertained by closing my eyes and pretending that Said was talking there. Said's coming. He's bringing his, his assault rifle and sniper rifle. And I don't know. Maybe he's confused. Maybe he thinks that the dark spawn are the blue suns. <laughs> ah, that makes sense. I mean, if you if you've got some uh, good voice talent in one game, you may as well rope them into other games as well. I'm sure they wouldn't be upset with the pay. Presumably. They might be. Do you have health? Do you have anything resembling healing? If it isn't the hero of the day, what can I get you? Health poultices. Right. I've got some supplies too, in case you're interested. With the store. Right. Out, it doesn't hurt to pick up some of the slack, eh? Mm. <sighs> Take the health one. Don't want the lesser one, though. Ale! That's a gift. Just one. I would have liked some more healing. Maybe the healing here is only finite. It shall be done. Okay, we might have to head to uh, Denerim and get some he try and find some healing there. Hmm. That is a possibility. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, I was going to try out. Um... Use it. not how you play a lute. You play a lute like you play a guitar. It's like holding it, not not putting it on the floor and picking it. Or at least that's I, at least I'm fairly sure that's the case. Admittedly, that's that's probably a better way, of, uh, probably an easy way of doing it. Is you just rather than coming up with a whole new set of um set of um. We could head back to who could head to the castle see if we can get some healing from them. 